Welcome to the Clockwork Carnival, a place where the air is thick with mystery and the shadows seem to whisper secrets of the past. In this chapter, we follow Evelyn Evie Hart and her friends as they delve deeper into the heart of the carnival, a place where the spirits of the past linger just beyond the veil of the living. The vibrant colors of the rides have faded, leaving behind ghostly shadows that dance along the cobblestone paths. Join us as we uncover the secrets hidden within the carnival's haunted attractions. Evelyn Evie Hart led her friends deeper into the park, her heart pounding with a mix of fear and determination. The broken heart carousel loomed ahead, its painted horses frozen in a perpetual state of longing, their eyes hollow yet filled with an unspoken sorrow. As Evie approached the carousel, she felt a chill run down her spine. The whispers of the past echoed in her ears, urging her to uncover the truth behind the park's tragic history. Beside her, Oliver Bolly Reed, with his tousled dark hair and warm brown eyes, sensed the weight of the spirit's presence. His empathy deepened, and he reached out, fingers brushing against the cold metal of the carousel's ornate pole, as if seeking a connection to the lost souls trapped within. Max, the skeptic of the group, hesitated at the edge of the ride, his brow furrowed in doubt. The shadows seemed to taunt him, and for a moment, he felt the familiar sting of childhood memories, of a bully who had once haunted his every step. The spirit of that bully, a boy with a cruel smile and mocking laughter, flickered in the corner of Max's mind, forcing him to confront the fears he had buried deep within. Lila Monroe, with her curly auburn hair and bright blue eyes, stood close to Max, her patchwork dress swaying gently in the breeze. She sensed his turmoil and whispered words of encouragement, reminding him that they were all in this together. The carousel began to spin slowly, the haunting melody of its music box filling the air, drawing them closer to the spirit's stories. Each ride they encountered became a portal to the past, revealing the park's tragic history. The Ferris Wheel of Regrets creaked ominously, each cabin a whisper of lost dreams and unfulfilled promises. As they climbed aboard, the atmosphere thickened with tension, and the group felt the weight of their own insecurities pressing down upon them. Evie's resolve strengthened as she realized that they were not just uncovering the spirit's tales, they were also confronting their own. The echoes of regret reverberated through the park, intertwining with their fears and desires. The stakes were rising, and the group understood that they must help the spirits find peace, or risk being consumed by the darkness that lingered in the shadows.